What is going on YouTube? This is Anthony once again with you back with another video. Today we are going over the DSR Pro 619D two-way radio. This one's pretty cool. We're going to take a look at it right here. This is the box it comes in. Standard stuff. Open it up. Take a peek. Operations manual. Uh, this thing inside is going to have everything you need to go over the radio if you're stuck. If you have any questions about it, uh, anything that you really can't figure out, this is going to be your go-to. Uh, instead of trying to search around online, this would be your best bet first. Let's go ahead and take a peek at the radio itself. This here is the 619D. Pretty simple. Uh, it's pretty nice, pretty sleek, clean. Uh, it looks like it has a metal chassis on it. Uh, tough, rugged plastic. It's pretty durable in the water, the dust, the rain. So if you're outside or just facing harsh elements at times, this is something you would really want to consider. Uh, if it does hit by you know chance fall out of your pocket or uh, kind of gets roughed around a little bit, especially on construction sites, things of that nature, obviously you know it's going to be something that can hold its own, take a couple bangs uh, before you really need to start thinking about replacing it if it does get that damaged. So let's go ahead. Take out the battery pack itself. All we're doing is basically trying to line it up. So we look at the battery, the back of the battery, the back of this. Pretty much opening it up, slide it in. You'll hear the click. On the top here you have your channels. It looks like it has 1 through 16. Uh, it can hold 256 channels total. This dial here is your volume power on and off. So we'll go ahead, turn that on, get a nice screen, DSR Pro will pop up, might take a couple seconds, and there we go. Channel 1 pops up, so you'll see that, the zone you're in. Uh, the 452, that is the frequency number. Uh, if you want to take a look at anything else, you could always use the menu. Everything that's on here, basically your call logs, contacts, scan, Messages, zones, settings, select, uh, basically anything that you would need uh, is right here at your convenience. Everything is on this. Radio information. So basically everything you need is on the radio itself. We'll go ahead and set that back down. So obviously standard everything comes with uh, the radio in this box. We'll go ahead and stick the antenna on. Basically just screws in at the top here. Frequency range is pretty good. Uh, this thing is digital and analog, so it is pretty nice. Uh, it has a bunch of different features. One of them is the channel lock, uh, SOS alarm, voice encryption. Uh, on the side here, it has the two pins, so pretty standard. The cord isn't too expensive at all, very affordable. If you ever have to upload different frequencies, if you get new radios in the future, uh, or just looking to see what kind of frequencies you might have standard stock that comes on all radios. Uh, this would be the side, the port you would use for that. Okay, we'll go ahead, take out the charger. This is the pod for the charger. So basically with this, all you're looking to do is take the back end of the radio. These dots here will line up with the inside three dashes inside the pod itself. All you're doing is sliding it in. You'll hear the click and it just stands stationary. And then right here is the cord. So all you need to do basically is take this cord, find the back here, plug it in. It's just a standard outlet, any household outlet. Plug it in. You will see and notice that on the bottom here it has a complete and it has charging. So the complete, if it's a solid green, that means that it's fully charged, it's ready to go. Charging is red, most of the time it would be blinking. Uh, so if obviously it's still charging, let it go to the complete cycle. That's how you know you'll be completely charged up. And then we'll go ahead, this is also a uh, wristband, just in case you know, you're out in the fields, you're running around, stuff happens where you just want that extra security, this would be it. Basically all this is, comes with a little loop on the back. You're going to flip the radio over to the back side. So as we were talking it the first time, you have the channels here, you have the power. 
on the back here all you're taking is this little loop on the back of the string itself you're gonna find a little tiny loophole there all you're doing is sticking it in tightening it and then you can walk around if you don't have a belt clip obviously this would be kind of a secondary thing to use the DSR Pro 619D radio comes with many features. It's tough, durable, has a full metal chassis, can withstand the elements, it's both digital and analog, and comes with a two year warranty. This is Anthony from Big Time Battery. Be sure to check out the links below, like, comment, and subscribe.